Hello, this is not a spring chicken. The big news today is, oh, there is absolutely no inflation. It's not going, no inflation? No. 2%? No inflation going on. But the market, oh wait, no, they said it was 2%? It's less than 2% Less than 2%. Inflation. Wow. And the market is going wild. Okay, the other thing they're going wild about in LA is Brit Week has just started, which is a couple of weeks of all things British here in the United States. Well, other than the person who's standing next to the camera who's not, I he's know. not welcome because well, his family are Jewish. Ooh, Jewish, British they don't royalty. Like the, they do, like, yeah, they do not know. like Jewish people in the royal. Mm, that's kind of interesting. Well, for now, we're going to bring old Kim on with comments on the headlines of today. And Obama, I wasn't born with a silver spoon in my mouth. I mean, he's got, he just pounds, and uh, okay, once again, Rex worships the ground, the president works on like Bill O'Reilly does. So I have to cover Rex's ears when I say, the man has had everything in his god darn life handed to him. And he'd never really worked a day in his life. And they say, well, he was a teacher. Well, not a very good one because he never read the Constitution. Uh -huh. No, but they don't consider a lot of people really that. Okay, uh, okay, the, here's how it's always been in, this, in, the, in the world. Those that can do, do, and those that can't become teachers. You realize that you can make a god-awful amount of money as a teacher and never work a day? Oh, yeah, we've seen that. Yeah. The brigade that posed with dead bodies showed signs of trouble. Oh, I mean, the, the Democrats basically, they're anti-military, so they're spreading. Uh, I, I, we've done this about a zillion times. My father used to pose, my father and his, in the 3rd Army Corps, and the 9th Armored Division used to pose with lots of dead bodies. That were to show people, we, we, we did this, folks. It's not, the troops have been doing it since the days of the first time a military went into action. You know, they used to take the heads off of people as, uh, as souvenirs. And Bloomberg moves towards ban on smoking in apartments. Uh, yeah, and they've already said that that's not constitutional, but Democrats don't care about whether things are constitutional or not. They just do it. Mm -hmm. And Obama says Republicans want women to be hurt with their continued war on women. Oh, that's the latest thing last night all over television trying to stomp on. Women, Republicans are, are basically making women target for every vile, vile crime in the history you know, in this country. Because they're, they're, they're continued war on women. No, the Republicans are not supporting a re-upping of this act that basically extends uh, uh, protection to everybody. Okay. It, 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 it theoretically it provides protection for pedophiles from being uh, mm -hmm. taken to court, and they said no. They want the rule. They want it. They want it changed. So it's, it basically says, you know, these people, these people, these people. Not everybody that's considered to be a minority. If you're a minority, which means, well, I think I love my horse today. You can't take me to court because it's not illegal according to our Congress. And Romney tied with Obama in new poll, but likability is an issue. Well, you know, nobody likes Romney. Everybody dislikes Romney. I mean, but, um, but uh, you know, it's because the Republicans don't really give a rat's ass whether he wins or not. If he wins, good. One of them is in office. If he loses, they got an attack against the Democrats for four more years, which folk, he don't intend to step down from office. Mm -hmm. He has, there's no constant, there's nothing in the Constitution that can order a setting president to lost an election to step down. Only the Congress of the United States, the Supreme Court has no authority. Only the Congress can do it, and they control the Senate. And if the Senate does not vote to throw him out of office, he can sit there forever, and a new president can never take office, because the Senate also has to see him. Oh. Yep. And 16 Amish pleads not guilty in Ohio. Ohio hair attacks? Yeah, they, they basically, uh, they, they cut the beards and the hair off of, of uh, other people in another sect in order to teach them a lesson. Oh, really? Well, the Amish are basically starting to lose very much favor all over the place because they want, they're writing, they're, they say, well, we pay taxes, yeah, but they also don't put, they also don't pay attention to turn indicators and stoplights on the back of their buggies, which is all they got to do. All they got to do? Yep. Um, and U.S., China assisting North Korean missile program. Only Obama didn't know this. Only the President of the United States. I mean, come on. He is the only person on the face of this planet. Well, I can guarantee you this morning they made the announcement that the Obama, the, that Obama basically went over to Congress of the United States and decided to do 
um, foreign policy on his own, which is against the Constitution. And uh, he said, they said this morning that, that what he did was for the best interest of the world. And, uh, and they're showing results of it. Well, the, the Iranians are going to stop their nuclear production in order to, to not have the san Obama sanctions on them. And they said, just like the Koreans stopped their nuclear, their nuclear program and their missile program because they were afraid of the sanctions that Obama was putting on them without, the act, without Congress approval. Mm -hmm. So they said they expect the nuclear weapons to continue to be built, but Obama's going to put up their, I stopped the nuclear program. Here's the problem with we'll putting Rex's ears over him. The first time the Koreans really set off a nuclear bomb someplace and that the Iranians set a nuclear bomb flying, Obama is going to basically flee to some friendly country where he can hide out from the... They're going to charge him with war crimes, folks, for real. Because yeah. he refused to do anything to stop all of it. The world's oldest living man celebrates 115th birthday. I know. It's a low news day because if they didn't they do that yesterday? I think it's, the, it's the sort of safe stuff from yesterday. It is a new news thing, but it's that it, it sounds like old news. And McQuain, McCain tweets quip about Obama eating his son's dog. Yep, definitely old news because actually, but it's not really old news because they said the comics are really having a field day with Obama eating dog. They said now we understand why Obama didn't have any dog because Michelle wouldn't didn't want to have to cook it. Ooh, yeah. well, we know this one's definitely news, which is Beyonce tops people's most beautiful list. Okay, I, I also heard a comic this morning who is very left-wing and has his own talk show. He said it's a good thing that, uh, you know, Miles Maberly wasn't out there because if Beyonce hadn't been around, they'd have politically corrected the only black woman in the show business with a name to be the most beautiful woman in the world. Okay, I, but not Beyonce is not really that god awful. She got a big butt, she can't dance, she can barely sing, and she is the most beautiful woman in the world. She also happened to be politically correct. Well, and then what about J Lo? Uh, but she's not politically correct. No, J Lo was, what was it? She just, what was it? She won about six months ago at a most whatever. Oh, she basically, uh, it had to do with the fact that she's, she's, it, okay, the woman is. What was it? Women okay. of the decade. Well, women we're going to try to put it this way. Most in okay, um, what it was. Uh, Jennifer Anderson was a teenage girl when In Living Color was on. Jennifer Lopez was older than her when the show was on. Now Jennifer Lopez is younger than Jennifer Anderson. Oh, really? Yeah. Mm hmm. And Rice, Christy, and Rubio top the VP polls. Yeah, the problem is um, Rice is not going to do it because she's you know too old. They're not going to nominate another woman after you know. Um, uh, Rubio is not going to get it because Rubio is totally on the wrong side of the party. On he wants to do a thing that forgives everybody in this country. You can be on their path to citizenship. The, the they said sixty six percent of the people in this country want the people to pay a penalty for being here illegally, folks. Mm -hmm. uh, and they, and uh, they can't get it through their heads. That, that you're, if you put Rubio on the ticket, he'll get them maybe a, a few percentage points on the Latino vote, and then the people on the right would have sat on their hands and they hand the election to Obama. And North Korea boasts it has powerful weapons that could defeat the U.S. More than likely, it's called a nuclear weapon. And they also do germ warfare with their folks. So. Uh, and Obama trusts them. He did say, you know, if you don't stop what you're doing, we're going to send Hillary over there to talk to you. Ooh. What scared him? And the longest serving Pennsylvania congressman loses in primary. Yeah, basically the Democrats are being tossed out of office, folks. I mean, they know that uh, they put in a person that can't beat the Republican. Because they, they, the guy basically... All you had to do was to be a massive supporter of Obama spending and you're being removed from office all over the country. Ooh. And longest, oh, and boy awaiting heart transplant abducted from St. Louis Hospital? Yeah, well, they, they basically found him just a little while ago. I mean, they're, they're trying to figure out what in the heck is going on. That's kind you of strange. You take a kid that's dying out of a hospital, why? Yeah. An Empire State Building about to lose status as the tallest in New York City. It wasn't the tallest in New York City. The towers were. So it hasn't, oh, it, it I hasn't see. been the tallest in New York City in a long time. It's just when you blow a couple of buildings down that are much taller, it then becomes tall again. So. Um, Animonte Bubble is in front of Mark Twain of the Animal Kingdom. 
Well, sometimes it is best to call.